This does appear to be a potentially combustible mix to guys that have liked to do it their own way and don't mind button heads over the years. Yeah, but you know what? I don't think Jimbo had any choice. Um, he he had to to make this move, and he had to do it with somebody that he can completely walk away from it and trust that it will be done right. Trust that it will be coached up. I mean, this is a tried and true, proven offensive system for decades. Um, it's produced outstanding college quarterbacks. Uh, it's a great balance between run and pass. And so I think if you know for, from Jimbo Fisher's perspective, he needed to get to a point where he can get back to leading the program, not the offense. Get back to being the head coach of the program, not the head coach of the offense. And while this on the surface may look like two combustible, combative, uh, type A personalities, which I think they are, but it might have needed to be that way because I think he needs to be able to walk away from it and not, not wonder if he made the right choice or if it's going to get done right. He'll know it because if you can say what you want about Bobby Petrino, but the guy can coach some football. And again, his offenses are tried and true.